Hey friends, welcome back to my channel. Dollar Tree has started to put out all of their new items for Easter 2024. So in today's video, I'm going to bring you with me so we can check out all of the new finds. And of course, I'm going to be sharing my top items for this year. And if you are new here, please do consider subscribing down below. We're going to get started on this end cap because this is what I saw as soon as I walked in. And a lot of these items are ones that I have seen before, but there were definitely a few new items. So I really like that sign back there. I did end up picking that up. Dollar Tree did have these pillow covers last year, but they are really cute for $1.25. First, we have the bunny headbands. These are great for Easter baskets. I actually use these sometimes in my DIYs, and there were a few new ones this year that I thought were really fun and different. They have a bunch of more traditional ones, but I really thought that the ones with the sequins were so much fun. And they also had these ones here with a little bunny instead of the ear. Adorable. The bunny and chick soap dispenser are back. They had these last year, but my Dollar Tree did sell out of those very quickly, so I did want to point those out in case you wanted to pick them up this year. Over here, we have a lot of items that are perfect for an Easter basket. These little bags are so cute. I believe the face with the bunny who is smiling is a new one with the eyes closed. Really cute. Tree also brought back the carrot burlap bags. I love those for DIYs, but again, great to put little items in. Over here, we have a bunch of little fun pencils and toys. And I thought that these were so cute. I know Dollar Tree has had these before, but they are just adorable. And for some reason, I really liked these erasers. I just thought they were fun. Was happy to see that Dollar Tree brought back the large bunny and egg containers, the ones that you can open and put items in. These are great for DIYs, and I will definitely be doing a DIY with the egg one this year. Over here was their wall of mini Easter eggs. Again, perfect for an Easter basket. And then over here, they had a bunch of their signs. I'm just going to do a pan over so you can kind of see all of the ones that they had. I will point out a few of my favorites. Over here coming up are some of the ones that I thought were a really great buy. So these larger signs here, you can see the large bunny girl in the front there, and then the boy is hidden in the back. They're a really great size. This one up here, I love where it says, welcome to our carrot patch. I think it looks great. It would be perfect for the center of a wreath. The bunny on a bicycle is hands down my favorite sign. I just think it is so cute. Of course, they had a bunch of window clings. I'm just going to go through a couple of them quickly, but of course, you guys know I do love to use these for DIYs as well as decorating. And these signs, I do believe, are new. So they are yard signs. They're pretty large. They have a few different styles, and they're really fun. I could definitely see arranging these with some faux florals or in a centerpiece. Just want to mention, if you are new here, I would love to have you join us by subscribing to my channel. We make a lot of DIYs, and I do have brand new Easter Dollar Tree DIYs coming up very soon that I am very excited about. I really hope that you guys are going to enjoy this year's set of DIYs. I think that they are my favorite yet for Easter. You love gnomes. You really can't go wrong with these for $1.25. They have so much detail. They're a great size and they are really cute. Dollar Tree did also have this bunny felt garland for $1.25, and I thought that this was a really good price for this one, and I do believe that it is new for this year. And I did actually just want to share these garden signs really quickly. They're not really Easter, they're more spring, but for $1.25 for a garden sign, it is a great deal. Now we are heading over to my favorite area, the DIY area. So there are some new finds this year. These egg signs here, I do believe are new. They are self-standing. They have a bunch of different styles, really fun for DIYs. These are also brand new. So these are wreath kits. They have two for Easter, the bunny and the chick. These are adorable. They also have these for Halloween, you guys might remember. Definitely can use these in a wreath, but they are also great for a bunch of other DIYs. And of course, I did pick up those as well. There were also a lot of different carrots this year at Dollar Tree. They had the bottle brush ones, large ones, some smaller ones, self-standing ones, lots of varieties to choose from. Of course, I had to share the Dollar Tree bunny rabbit. This one goes so quickly. It's an oldie but a goodie. Dollar Tree usually has these each year, but by me, they sell out so fast because people love to decorate them. Fun for DIYs, you can give them a hat and a necklace. There are so many possibilities. Now this is one of my top finds this year for Easter. I was so excited to find these. I saw these on the Dollar Tree website and was so happy that they had them in person. They are these super large blank signs. They have four different designs. They have the bunny, the chick, the egg, and the carrot perfect for DIYs. I got a bunch of those. 
here we have another Dollar Tree staple, the six pack of faux eggs. I use these pretty much every year, my DIYs. They also have the gold variety. And we also have a few more window clings. These ones are a little bit different than the other ones though, because in these, you do get two sets in one. They also had these super vibrant dish towels, really, really pretty. And they only had one of these left, but they were this set of mini spatulas, really cute to go with the towel. That would make a really fun gift to just put both of those together, especially if you're making a little Easter basket for a friend. You can even add this as well. It's a little bunny tail ice cube tray, but of course you can use it for melting wax melt or even chocolate, really versatile. They also had two of these little candles here, two different varieties. They have the light pink shell as well as the hot pink. And there was also a bunch of Peeps merchandise going throughout the store. I'm going to point out more of it later. Over here, we have some wood signs, a bunch of ribbon. I was really excited to see all of these beautiful pastel colors. I was looking for some pink gingham ribbon. I didn't see it on this day, but I will definitely go back and check out the ribbon again. They also had a ton of tool and a bunch of beautiful bright pastel colors. She has so many baskets for Easter, so I'm not gonna point them all out, but this one here is my favorite. I think it is so cute. This is just great to keep year after year. It is adorable. They also had these trays. I didn't pick up one of these and now I am seriously regretting it. This is perfect when you are dying eggs or if you just want to display some deviled eggs for Easter, really great for $1.25. They also had these same galvanized buckets that they had last year and a bunch of these wood blanks. My favorite find here is this one. This is the pack of 12 bunnies with the little cotton ball tail. They did have these last year, but they look very high end in a lot of different DIYs. Definitely grab a pack of those if you find them. I am so curious to know what is your Easter decor style? Let me know if you can in the comments down below. I'm just really curious. For me, I definitely like a more neutral Easter decor. I like a little bit of vintage, but I do also enjoy pops of pastel colors, the light pink, purple, even a little bit of green, but there are so many different styles for Easter. So let me know, cause I'm curious kind of what you guys really enjoy. Do you want that super bright, vibrant Easter? Or do you kind of like more of a rustic, shabby chic Easter? There are a lot of different styles. So just let me know because I am curious. Mini moss bunnies are another great find. They definitely have that high-end feel to them. And I found only one pack of these eggs here. I did pick them up, but I thought they were really pretty. They would be perfect to use on this Easter tree. If you don't have that one yet, I actually have mine still from last year. And now we are gonna move on over to the dollar plus area because they had some amazing, amazing items this year. These two metal signs I did pick up. These were $5 each, but they are large and substantial and so beautiful. I love them. They also had the duck as well, but I did get the two bunnies. Another really great find was this bunny tray. This one is $5 and I thought it was a great buy. It's really sturdy and so cute. They also had a lot of garlands and these were only $3, which I thought was pretty reasonable. So that these eggs here were also pretty large and substantial and they were only $3. They also had a bunch of bunny rabbits to choose from, ranging from three to $5. And this gnome here I thought was particularly adorable. He's really big, has such a fun beard and has those beautiful pastel colors. All of these rabbits here were $3. My favorite were probably the light pastel flocked ones, but I do love that green moss as well. These eggs also sell out very quickly. They are great to DIY if you don't love the colors, but again, a great buy for five bucks. You can get some really big decor. These bunnies are also $5. They had a few different styles, pretty tall and make the perfect door greeter. I thought that this bunny here was really pretty as well. If you love a super girly Easter decor, this might be your style, really fun and vibrant. They also had this style here with the bunny sitting down and both of these signs were $3 each. Next up is a more rustic Easter sign, really fun, has the chicken wire with the egg shape. This one here I thought was really pretty as well. It is a little bit small. It was $5, but it was really nice quality. And they have this style with the galvanized bunny instead. This rabbit is another one of my top finds. 
I think that it looks so beautiful. This definitely has the rustic look and it is pretty large. So I was just trying to kind of show you the size of it here and it's pretty big. It is plush and it's only $3. The ears are completely poseable. They have the metal wire in them. So you can kind of make one standing up, one flopping down, a lot of different ways to style it. And when I first saw it, I was just assuming it was going to be $5 because of the size of it and was very happily surprised to see it was only $3. Here is a few more of their garlands. They also did have this set of string lights with the bunny and the carrot. I thought that those were pretty fun. These were $5 up is a few more peep finds so if you love peeps definitely check out the dollar plus area they had this ribbon here this one is a bit more expensive but you do get some larger ribbon for three dollars as opposed to the dollar 25 ribbon they also had these peeps here in a few different colors five dollars each these bunnies were another one of my top finds. I think that they are so cute. They are $5 each, but if you do see similar ones at Michael's, usually they're a little bit more expensive than that. And I thought that these were really cute. Love the one with the glasses. The girl one was also really adorable with the roses in her hair. And that is everything for today. I really hope that you guys enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe to my channel and definitely come back very soon because I don't want you to miss out on any of the new Dollar Tree Easter DIYs.